everyone. So it's Tuesday the 14th of May and continuing with the theme of gratitude I'm just going to pick a card for Tuesday to see what we might focus on. Um, right okay so it's the Archangel deck and we've got prosperity. Right so just to talk a little bit about that what I want to say is okay so there are a lot of us at the moment who are concerned about having our material needs met and of course, you know, in the wider scheme of things, we're seeing a lot of things in the economy um, that are really making people feel quite nervous as well. And I feel that what this card is saying is, well, in terms of gratitude, what we really need to do is to see abundance everywhere, see abundance all around us, and then find it within ourselves somehow to be grateful for what we already do have. And we are already, every single one of us, if you are sitting somewhere watching this video, you are more prosperous than you think because you have access to that sort of technology and you have access, therefore, to an abundance of resources that can help you to, to think better thoughts, to clear the past, to resolve, to, to create change within yourself and collectively. So that's one thing to immediately be grateful for. So I'm going to start today and I'm going to put aside any concerns that I might have and I'm just going to say I am very grateful that I am actually speaking to you through this um, medium and I'm very grateful that I'm able to do that. I'm very grateful that I'm able to connect with you with this message and um, yeah, I'm going to read the card. It says, Archangel Ariel says, your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. So what the card is also saying is, okay, so we're looking at the theme of gratitude. We're looking at gratitude because it helps us to open the heart and that raises our frequency. But also in terms of um, following our intuition, we also need to have our hearts open to do that because if we're closed down, it's very, um, it's quite common for us to not be able to hear or feel the guidance that's coming to us because it does tend to come through the heart quite a lot. It's not always that we hear things. It's not always that we sense things or that we just have a knowing. Or rather, if we do just have a knowing, we tend to be knowing through the heart. And when we do hear things, we often think we're hearing them with our ears, but we're actually feeling them with our hearts and hearing them with our ears. And even when we see pictures, we see things clairvoyantly, we're still connecting with the pictures through our hearts in order to understand what they mean. So you could see a butterfly on 50 different days and it will have 50 different meanings. Or you could see a tortoise on 50 different days and it would have 50 different meanings because each time your heart will tell you if your heart's open, ah, oh, that means that I'm, uh, I don't know, I'm transforming or that means I'm going too slowly or that means I'm going too fast or whatever. So really this is about moving towards our dreams, moving towards prosperity by trusting what we're feeling. And um, a lot of us will have had a big lesson about this recently. I've had a very big lesson about this. And it's really just a reminder today that if you're not sure about something or if you're in doubt about creating abundance, manifesting your dreams or any of those things on that frequency. Come back into the heart, do a little bit of a meditation on it. This is going to be a good day to reconnect with that. What's real about this? Why isn't the, the abundance flowing in this area? Why isn't it happening? Is it because maybe I'm not on an energetic path that's in alignment with where, what I'm really supposed to be doing, what I'm really, where I'm really supposed to be? Because when we do that, it does things do start to open up. And then the challenge, of course, is to trust and to walk through those doors when they open up. But that's another day and that's another story. So for today, it's really about trusting our intuition to manifest our dreams into reality. And if your heart feels closed and you can't trust your intuition, focus on something that's really good. Right now, find one thing that's really good, one small thing that you can feel really grateful about and then start a whole cycle, a whirlpool of gratitude and think, well, okay, I feel grateful for that as well. I feel grateful for that too. Make a whole list of things you feel grateful for. And when your heart feels really open, drop into your heart, close your eyes and meditate on where can I find abundance? What truth will lead me to abundance? Okay, that's it for today. And I'll be back tomorrow for Wednesday's Angel Hug. Happy Tuesday. Bye.